Hi and welcome to this look at the 1.04 update for V Rally 4, which hit today, the 18th of September. Um, so they've added some more stuff in on the car liveries, um, so they can be shown online. Added an end user licensing agreement around that. Um, you can also now have um, tips in the um, editor as well, which is useful but I've not had a chance to play around with that for the simple reason that you still can't use it if you've got a wheel plugged in because the right three and left three button don't work that still means that also that replays are useless um, in uh, if you've got a wheel because you can't turn the overlay off in that so you can't use photo mode either and you have to crop out replays if you can include them in videos great fun um, so some AI and minor bug fixes that have been put in place. Uh, you do now have the ability to hide the steering wheel in cockpit view, which I know a few people have been asking about. And the one annoying song can now be switched to an instrumental version, um, which doesn't make any difference to me because I've switched the music off in menus anyway. Uh, however, along with the lack of effects for the replay overview and photo mode overview when you're using a wheel, the tyre bug, which is the subject of one of my other videos and I did mention in the review as well, is still very much present, uh, which is quite frustrating because for me this is the single biggest issue with the Rally 4 at the moment. Uh, get that fixed, I'm going to enjoy it a hell of a lot more. Um, but there we go, that's a very quick overview on version 1.04 for V Rally 4. Uh, all of this was on the uh, PlayStation 4 as well. So uh, if you found this useful, please do hit the like button. Um, if you've not already subscribed and you want to see more like this, you know what to do. And uh, if you've got any feedback or thoughts of your own, please do add them into the comments down below. Thanks very much. Bye.